you guys were known, you know, sort of big guys, big bikes, big food, all of that sort of thing. Mm. So why change? Well, because <laughs> we were really fat. Yeah. I think the <laughs> the, the, Fundamentally. The medical profession applied the term morbidly obese, yeah. Yeah. which kind of, you know... It's if you, scary. Yeah, it is. But, I mean, you know, when you find yourself... I was borderline type 2 diabetic on statins for cholesterol and blood pressure tablets. And it's kind of like, mm, if the prescription for that is mm. shedding the weight, oh, I'm overweight and I'm never going to be a skinny mini, yeah. but at least I'm, I'm not going to yeah, pop any me day. clogs you in ten years. You were very poorly, yeah? though, weren't you? I was, yeah. Yeah, I was. I was very poorly. And what, what, it was, it's interesting because you just kind of... I think part of the success about the mm. books is that... that Nobody lives in a bubble. Life gets in the way. So you put, if you have a propensity to put weight on, uh, you do. Um, mm -hmm. And I, I, had a, I had a brain aneurysm, and um, I couldn't do anything. So it, during the rehabilitation, the weight piled on again. So, um, and I, I just thought, well, I need to do something about it, and hence the, hence the book. Because the thing is, you, you're obviously foodies. I'm mm. a foodie. I love buying food. I love mm. cooking food. I love sharing food. Mm. And it's, it's a real shame, really, the, all these lovely things that we want to eat, all these big meals, all these Sunday yeah. roasts. Ah, uh, you see, you see. Go on, tell me the good news. Well, the great news is that what Dave and I do with, these, with, with the diet books is that we make sure that it comes from a place of great tasting food first mm. Mm. that happens to be less calorific. So how can we actually make that great dish that everybody loves, everybody craves, less calorific? And that's how we approach it. We don't do it the other way. And how way. do you do it then? Do well, you well, just not like, cook with like butter? Things like are great because, um, you know, the, the, there are no calories in flavour. Mm. And like, like in a new book, because we wanted the food to be done fast. That's one of the problems. It's... The problems that we have, we've tried to identify and fix. One of the problems we had is that when you're hungry, if you've managed not to snack and not, not to eat kind of too much at lunchtime, mm. you really want the food quickly when you get in. So we wanted the food to be ready in less than half an hour. Mm. So things like curries, our diet curries have been really successful. But if you do it in a pressure cooker, you get right. all the flavour and everything. And you, and you can do like a lamb dan sack with, with the lentils from, from the bag in 14 minutes. Mm -hmm. wow. um, things like these desserts here. Which uh, we can smell. Yeah, coconut. it's a coconut macaroon, but it's, you don't like the old fashioned ones, not your fancy French ones. But what we've done is carrot cake works. Mm -hmm. So we mix the carrot with the it's coconut. It's like the inside of a bounty. Yeah, but it's 80 calories a, <laughs> yeah. a pop. Much so so one of those and a cup of tea, that'll see you through till your tea time. Mm -hmm. That's really And what's in that? It's got it's carrot good. in it as well. Carrot, yeah. just to keep it moist. So you've got like that. Carrot cake. It's yeah. like carrot cake. Um, and they're, they're great, aren't they? Really delicious. So you yeah. can, you, so you, you know, because everybody's weight loss journey is very personal to them, isn't mm. it? Mm. Um, and, and, you know, little treats like that just make it sustainable. So of grabbing a naughty biscuit exactly. with a cup of tea. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Grab a something. A couple of people have come up to you. And it has really changed their one yeah. guy and profoundly changed their life. Oh, God, oh yes. gosh, yeah. yeah. There was yeah. there was one man, he was at a book sign, he came up and he was really quite emotional. And he said, thank you for the books. He said, it saved two lives. I said, well, what do you mean? Oh, he said, well, he said, my son was waiting for a kidney transplant and I was the one who was going to be the donor, but they wouldn't let me donate a kidney because of my weight problem. Oh. I said, so I used the books, <laughs> lost the weight, donated a kidney, and he was there with his son, both bursting with life and fit oh than God, ever. Oh, my God, that's amazing. Uh, we, 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 we never thought anything like this would come of it. No, we didn't. Another guy who, uh, who thought there was something <laughs> yes. wrong with him, didn't he? He did, he went to the doctor because he was losing weight. Oh. And uh, he went to the doctor and he said, listen, man, I did, there's, there's something wrong, I'm losing weight, I'm losing weight. He says, well, you look all right. So he went, and he hadn't said anything to his wife, so he went back to his wife and said, listen, I don't think I'm very well. I'm losing weight. And they said, you daft flamer. I've put you on a diet. <laughs> then they should put, her, should put him on the hairy biker's diet. So, and not and, told him. And not told him. And he hadn't noticed any difference in food, because he's not eating diet food, he's eating great taste. I, I think at the time... And he like, was losing stores. You know, we'd, we'd written a recipe for, like, a diet donner kebab. So he'd come home from work and have his diet donner <laughs> and a bit of curry. But he was... He cut his calorie intake... You know, by, by half. By half. Do you do a roast? Can you do a diet roast? Yes, yeah. yeah of course. So what do you do for roast potatoes then? Well, you just you can have one or two, but you know there, there, so there is a point. Portion control, also it is. Yeah, it? And, and, and or roasted you... cauliflower instead of the roasted potatoes. Yeah. Or sweet you potatoes. Changing. You can roast sweet potatoes, really, really nice. Cauliflower rice, we do a lot of making a cauliflower rice pilaf. Um, experimenting making pizza bases out of ground cauliflower. And oh actually, wow! Yeah, That's think brilliant. about the tomatoes and the cheese. Mm, it goes with cauliflower, but your salami and everything. The sausage, say chorizo sausage, so full of flavour, a little goes a long way. So Merengues as well. No. So, yeah, and it's about flavour, and it's mm. about it's about the importance of, you know, there's no calories and there's no calories in spice. No. So you know, and 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 we kind of try and 
try and make sure but that it, I mean, all it, of it that... It shows that it works, because look at the pair of you. I mean, you are literally disappearing in front of our eyes. Well, 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 well I don't know about that, like, Philip. Well, thank you. That's very kind of you to say. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least these were kind of... A, we're down out the danger zone on that BMI meter. Yeah. Um, yeah. Well, using less fuel in the in the motorbikes, I yeah. thought, hauling you around. What's well, saving us well, fortunes? <laughs> twice a year, I have my blood sugars done since I had that scare four years ago, mm. and I can honestly say, since then, mm. my blood sugars have been normal. Mm. Um, the cholesterol's normal. And it's small changes. Small changes yeah. make a big difference. You don't have to take them. No. You don't have yeah. to take a mountain on. You just have to do it incrementally. What's the, um... And it was, and, and, it, and they're just, that just such small, tiny incremental changes to your lifestyle that make a massive difference. Or replacing and a certain ingredient. Exactly, yeah. and it's never yeah. too late. Well, what the one you campaign well, you're really. eating again, then. Oh, What's, yeah. um, I've eaten a lot today. I've had a burger, I've had macaroons. What am I eating now? It's like a deconstructed cheesecake. Cheese. But you see, you break, you break the base down, there's not so much butter. Can so you've you got see the that? texture of a cheese. That's a portion that we say, that's 200 calories. Oh, my God. You've got the fruit. The lime. There's lime in this, isn't there? Yeah, well, mm -hmm. citrus, flavours, yeah. satisfying. Passion fruit. Passion oh, fruit. Passion yeah. fruit. What's, yeah. the, what's the cheesecakey bit? Yogurt? It's a, a, a low-fat oh, cream cheese. cheese. This is really yummy. That's lovely. But it's kind of real food. Mm. With, a crunch, really with a crunch of the passion seed. Yeah. Well. yeah. yeah. Really but you know, like we're saying, Holly, that, that you love food and you love cooking. It's your hobby. Mm. That was a thing for us when we started mm. the diet. Why can't we've... my hobby be jogging? <laughs> 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 it's so unfair. <laughs> yeah, but you're happy. Uh, that's am. true. That's true. <laughs> Thank um, you very much. Guys, Thank really you. lovely to, mm. uh, to see you both. Hello, YouTube. For more of the same, just click here. And don't forget, you can subscribe for even more of these amazing videos exclusive to our channel. And you're yeah, the last mermaid. I am the last mermaid. So you play her. Yeah. Who, was who's that the, the first name on the sheet, right? If we're going to do this, I am <laughs> the last mermaid. Plus, I want to be a mermaid. I've been wanting to be a mermaid all my life. <laughs> yeah, something like that.